Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. I wish you all uh, the best in life, all success, happiness, and uh, safety. So guys, I'm so very happy today because I'm able to uh, invite my hubby over here to have a walk, a little walk. <laughs> but also only inside the property. But at least uh, he had a very little uh, exercise today and so let's go guys come with us enjoy our trip go <laughs> we are going to we are going to check some uh, beautiful where are you going hun okay we are while having our morning walk. We haven't really walked guys for a long time because this guy here is very lazy. Every time I plan to walk, to make a walk in the morning, he will just say, oh, not today. I'm tired. Not today. <laughs> it's always every day, not today. <laughs> so now he get the punishment. We walk uphill. <laughs> so this is uh, we are going to see the place, the specific place in the property where he wanted to build a sitting place because it has a little bit view to the ocean this is the highest part of the property as well so here comes our dogs so. my brothers who harvested the coconuts also clean the area bush the area so that's clean yes this boundary here that's the boundary okay. okay here we are here we are so that's the ocean right there guys we were planning to build a two-story little tower over here <laughs> have the the view okay keep going there is uh, there that's the bush over there it's bushy right there you don't see coconut trees there before they do the bushing. Okay, the dogs are on. Uh... So here, guys. In the old days, guys, no mga unang panahon, guys, these are all rice fields. During the time of our great grandparents, these are all rice fields from here. You see how how the party. That's uh so if we like build something from here, we have a little bit of overlooking view. Maybe we also need to cut trees in front. <laughs> That's the ocean view. And that's the tree where he wanted to have the sitting place. Yeah, all the way up where where they you see the difference be, between from the place where they bush and the next is a high bushes so that's that's the boundary of this property. So what is this property kind of go like this? Yeah, getting smaller, getting narrower up, yeah. going up. So guys, uh, the story of this property is this is like twelve hectares in to begin with and all of my siblings of my grandfather inherited 
so like there were like 14 siblings so they just divided it the, the that area there is another share of 3,700 square meters and the next also and the next and the next and the next and the next so this is a one hell big of property and divided to the siblings and now it's the grandchildren so this is our morning walk sige na go down na because it started raining guys as soon as we walk <laughs> huh? you go up a little farther Look here. Okay. He wanted to go up a little farther. And that is our neighbor, guys, uh, dealing with eggs. He grow uh, chickens that lays eggs. Uh, you're tired now? Speaking of which, we need some eggs. Yeah, but we don't have money. So we go, let's go, climb up there. Uh. Elsa, where's your boyfriend? Oh, here comes your boyfriend. So, yep. I think uh, during when we built the house, we needed uh, lumber. And you see that one hand? Uh, lightning strikes that tree. Yes. See that? So we have a coconut tree, guys. That's being struck by the lightning. Oh, it's dead now. Yep. So they cut two trees from here. So this is actually a nice place, hun. Yep. This is the, not the highest point yet, but there, we have the, the view. Yeah. Yep. Wait, careful. Careful. These aren't the best shoes for walking. You need a rubber shoes or tennis shoes. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because this is already a rocky, rocky place up to the. You see how bushy is the next property is. Yeah, they don't, they don't, they don't really clean. So how, how did they know where the boundary was up there? That, that has a, it has a barbed wire. The next, the next owner put a barbed wire. So that's the end of our property. Here also, my uncle have a barbed wire in the side, but it is easy to to determine because this has this has a long trees going down. Do you see that? There are the same, yeah, same old trees. So, so that's that's how that's how the property guys in the old old days. Their boundaries are just trees or or a certain. A specific tree or a big rock and people in the old days they don't really fight with right. the properties <clears throat> but people in this generation they had, a, they had an agreement between them. yeah they have a verbal agreement oh this is my property this is my land that is yours uh, these days guys they fight right. so the most important thing these days is to have the clean title or paperwork but that, that hard, doesn't, which, is hard, which is hard to get. The government doesn't make it easy to get. But uh, when we die, guys, we don't really take anything. We leave everything behind. 
So for me, we just I just wanted to have like clean relationship or good relationship with the owners next to our property and all is good. We have the understanding, like the guys over there, you know, we look know. The, look at this stupid American living in paradise here. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> how do you, how do you like your paradise, mister? I love being in the here. Really? Yeah. I should probably yeah. move from underneath the coconut tree. Huh? <laughs> no, they, they're nothing. I mean, there's nothing to fall because they clean it. And you see the you see the difference of uh, how fruits here bear fruits. I mean these coconuts they don't have much fruits, son, than the ones uh, below, because uh, the lower level or the lower portion gets the nutrients from here. They flushes <laughs> every time there's rain, it flushes. But I uh, during rainy season I I will plan to cultivate. Are you recording? Yeah. So anyways, no, it's, I love it here. It's great. Yeah, I'll have to come up here for sunset. Yeah. We can have a sit place from here. In this area. This is right. uh this is this is the highest point. And from here, Han, oh you can you can even see the island. Han, the island over there. From here. The island that one day we soon visit. We will. So. Take a boat trip out there. Yep. This is our property, guys. 3,700 square meters property. It gets narrower as it go higher, but down is wider where our home is. That the home. Yeah. The home and the pig pen. So. That's mom's house. Down that's home. mom's house. So basically guys, here in the province or here in the mountains, especially in our place, all of us are just relatives living next next to each property, not next to the house because we have a spaces between. So basically, if you own the 3,700 square meters property, you just live there. You know, no, <coughs> nothing, nobody else but your mom or your siblings but not uh, no other people no. even the guys that lives there that has eggs are our family we are our distant relatives so Joel is? yeah Joel is oh, I didn't know he was a relative. so uh, living in the mountains is really really nice you don't really you don't have to feel scared or afraid of bad people or something because we just know one another Bye guys, <laughs> hope you enjoyed the view. <laughs> That's our morning walk today. We consider it a morning walk. It's very short. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you have to include me in the video. Yeah. <laughs> there she is. And this is me. My beautiful honey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching guys. We will upload this video very soon. So. All right, take care everybody.